Hello friends. Today we are going to discuss the stereo microscopes. Stereo microscopes are also called as the stereo zoom or dissecting microscopes. The first pseudo stereo microscope was designed by Cherubin de Orleans in 1671 which has major flaws like need of additional lens system to achieve 3D views right side images were projected to left eyepiece and vice versa the credit for designing of true stereo microscope goes to francis herbert winham winham used a chromatic prism to split the light beam at the rear of a single objective the magnifying power of stereo microscope ranges from 7.5 to 75 x the stereo microscopes differ from compound light microscopes in that they have separate objective lenses and eyepieces allow production of 3d image of the specimen since two different optical paths create different angling views for left and right eyes while compound microscope produces 2d images the stereo microscopes also allow real time imaging of specimens stereo microscope uses reflected light from specimen while compound microscope uses transmitted light most but not all stereo microscopes use two light sources one above and one below the specimen while compound microscopes have single light below the specimen stereo microscope is ideal for study of opaque thick solid specimens while compound microscope need thin specimens for visualization thank you